Wow. Almost a hundred. Would have been nice, dude. Yo, what is going on, guys? It is your Hicks here, and welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be playing some Modern Warfare 2 because we have the GOATS. The GOATS on the screen right now. The winner of the World Cup, dude, Argentina. Messi, his first ever one. I had to jump on this game and buy him just so I could play as the GOATS of Call of Duty and football, soccer, however you want to call it. I don't really care. But yeah, no, I thought it would be pretty fun just playing as him in Call of Duty. I have him and Neymar currently, so... Depending on what team I'm on, that's who I'm going to be playing as. I've been getting a lot of Neymar for some reason, even though whenever I didn't have Messi, I would never get Neymar. But what are you going to do now that I actually want to play as someone else? They're going to give me the character that I actually wanted to play all the time. But I've been on this game grinding a lot, especially since we actually have shipment 24-7 now. It's been up for a couple of days with the double XP that's actually ending tomorrow. So that's why I'm currently up recording this video at 2.46 a.m because I've just been going through all of my weapons, at least trying to get them leveled up because uh, the leveling process is really the hardest part of this camo grind. And I don't know why I want this Orion camo, but I do. I used to grind Call of Duty a lot and get all of the mastery camos, but I've stopped since Modern Warfare 2019 and I haven't been back here since, but this has really been a lot of fun and shipment has definitely made it a lot better. But I'm about like halfway through, as you can see in my camo collection, 113 out of 203. I finished a lot of the stuff currently. So my ARs are all done. My battle rifles are basically all done. I just have to finish some of the camo challenges. My SMGs are all done. My shotguns, I just need two more. LMGs are all done. The marksman rifles are currently what I'm working on. The sniper rifles, I need to unlock these two anyway, which is why I'm on the marksman rifles. The riot shield, I am probably actually going to skip since we have some of the DLC weapons and this thing actually got nerfed, so I really don't feel like using it. And then I have some of the secondaries. I finished out the launchers, which... This, this Pila dude gave me a headache. The Pila and the Shrella were the worst guns I have ever used like in the entirety of Call of Duty that I've ever played. It was so bad. I'm so glad that I got those done and I'm not excited to use them again, but luckily it won't be as hard because I just have to shoot down score streaks and get double kills, which would be pretty easy on shipment. It's been going really fast. I have all of my secondaries to do, which honestly I feel like isn't gonna be that bad. I've been seeing people run around melting me with these on shipment, so I feel like these are gonna be really easy. The levels are just gonna take me a while, and then I have the knife. So it's really, really not that bad. We're gonna go into shipment while I just talk. This bundle has been out for a while, like since the World Cup started. That's why I bought, that's when I bought Neymar. I don't even know if you're able to buy him anymore or if it's just not popping it for me because I already have him. And as you can see, I've been playing this game a lot. I'm level 222, a lot of my guns are done and it has actually been a blast. Shipment like completely saved this game for me. I don't mind Shoot House. It was still kind of weird with all these people sitting back and like playing weird, even on shipment, they. Still Still play kind of weird too but at least it's a lot better and we can just run around and do whatever and for some reason whenever i'm playing shipment i just my brain turns off like i do not think of anything everything is really really good i'm so happy i just watch streams or listen to music and everything is totally fine so i'll probably have this camo grind done in probably like a week or so honestly and then i'll be able to make like videos on new guns that come out, which is what I've wanted to do for Call of Duty for a while now, but I just haven't been interested in the past Call of Duties, but this one's actually really fun, especially playing on this map. And I know I made like a vi like one video before playing this as well, but it wasn't anything too crazy. I just made like a gun that I thought that was really cool. It was a like bundle and I thought it was pretty cool. So I decided to make a video on it and it actually didn't do too bad. Um, I just had no idea of what I wanted to do for this game, but now that I'm going to be able to get this camo and actually have a good time playing this game, uh, I'll make some more videos on it because it's really fun. And I've been having actually a lot of fun sniping. Um, I most likely included some of the signal clips that I've been getting during that whole camo thing. And that gun was insanely fun. I don't know what that was. That was honestly a little bit more fun than the SPR 
when I was using it because it didn't get any hit markers, just like how I'm getting right now with this lock one, actually. But yeah, the signal was really, really fun. If they increased the ADSP just a tiny bit, that would be the best sniper in the game, honestly. It might even be the best sniper in the game. I'm really out of tune what's been going on in this game, but I just play it for my own enjoyment and I don't really care. I don't care to be up with the meta, even though I know that a lot of these guns are very insane, like the mini back and everything. I was shredding with that gun. No nukes dropped yet, but I have been very close and it probably will happen relatively soon. Would be nice. I don't think I'm gonna be going for like the full, full mastery stuff with like the charms and stuff because it doesn't really give you anything. And I could not care to get a thousand kills with all the launchers and stuff. No way am I doing that. So I'm just going until I get Orion. Then I'll be able to unlock it on like all the future guns that are coming out because I feel like that'll be pretty cool. And I haven't been able to do that in a, in a long time. Yeah, man. Speaking of Messi in the World Cup. Oh my God. What a game that actually was. I was at work when the game was playing and literally almost everyone at my work was watching the game while talking to customers. And I thought it was hilarious. And I was definitely one of those people that was watching the game while I was talking to customers. Luckily, I wasn't on too demanding of a position. And honestly, some of the customers actually watched with me and we talked about it a lot. And I thought it was so sick. As soon as Argentina scored their second goal, I was like, oh yeah, there's no way that France is gonna be able to come back. And then Mbappe freaking went crazy in 10 minutes and scored two goals back to back. And uh, dude, everyone was freaking out on my work and they, oh my God, what a game it was. And then they ended up scoring again. Mbappe gets a, a hat trick, which was wild. Honestly, Whichever team would have won, like say if Argentina didn't win, I honestly would have been okay with it because everyone was playing so insanely well. This was literally one of the best World Cups since like 2014, to be honest. And I'm super sad because Brazil didn't get to make it and obviously that is like my home country and I wanted them to win so bad, but this was a really, really good final and it was a blast to watch ended up going into penalties and then Argentina just ended up taking. I'm glad that Messi got to to show who the GOAT actually is and get a World Cup before he retires because I'm pretty sure he's not even going to be playing any more World Cups. That's going to be his last one. So it was very, very well deserved for him to bring home the World Cup for his for his last game. But Mbappe being the guy that he is, I feel like he is definitely going to be one of the best soccer players out there for a guy that's his age and has already won a World Cup and almost won a second one already, basically all by himself. Him scoring up the game 3-3, literally like all by himself, none of his other teammates made a goal is very, very impressive. So the dude is, the dude is crazy. He's definitely gonna be one of the best soccer players like he's gonna go down in history for sure. But I'm glad that Messi won. I know I keep saying Messi, even though I know it's Argentina, I just, I'm, I'm super glad for the dude, honestly. But yeah, I pretty much just wanted to give a quick update on what was going on. I still am gonna have my Overwatch videos coming out. I actually finally got an editor so they can edit that and I'll most likely just edit these Call of Duty videos myself because I do not know how to edit Overwatch videos. Like I am really, really bad at it. So hopefully the guy that I have is really, really good. And I'll have some more of those out because I have been grinding Overwatch a lot as well. I'm actually almost diamonds in my support. I've been playing a bunch of Lucio and actually been doing pretty good with him. I'm like high plat right now. I wanna see if I can get diamond. But yeah, that's where I'm at with Overwatch. Just gonna be playing casually and streaming it here and there on the side and playing Call of Duty as well. Just making like videos and commentaries and just talking about some stuff and playing some of these new games that are gonna be coming out soon as well. So I'm pretty excited for everything that's gonna be coming. But yeah, that is pretty much it for like the update. I definitely have to go to bed after this game because it is 3 a.m. and I need to be up in a couple of hours. So that's gonna be really fun trying to wake up for that. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Thank you for joining me on this journey of switching up games. I know a lot of people subscribe to me for Apex, but I have just been enjoying playing other games right now. And you guys will definitely see all of that in my channel. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe down below as it does help out the channel very greatly. And I will catch you guys on the next one.
Oh, my God.